Okay guys, back on my channel update K-pop, now the news comes from Kim ji Won and Kim soo Hyun. Kim ji Won and Lovely Runner are now fighting against ticket scalpers, these illegal transactions need to stop. But what is more important is that the voice of purchasing tickets through them, the brokers, must also be stopped. Starting at 6 p.m. Korean time on the 22nd, ticket reservations for the joint viewing event for the final episode of the drama Lovely Runner were held on the CGV website. However, as soon as ticket reservations were opened, the server went down. After that, a post appeared about selling tickets in an illegal way. Among them, posts circulating in online communities reported that someone was seen ordering several tickets using the kiosk method, and in fact, many posts appeared on social networking sites selling Lovely Runner tickets at high prices beyond the original price. The original ticket price for the event to watch together the last episode of Lovely Runner was 1,000 won, but the tickets sold by the brokers were for 300,000 won. And there were also those who sold them by auction, saying, please bid more than 200,000 won. Complaints from fans who heard this news poured in, even Song Jeon-hee, who plays Kim Tae Song, also discussed it during the live broadcast. He also expressed his confidence by saying, they set the price at 1,000 won so that fans who like Lovely Runner can come see it, but it's not that expensive. In fact, this is not the first time there has been a war against ticket scalpers. Actress Kim ji Won also declared war on ticket scalpers. This is because ticket fraud was discovered ahead of the first fan meeting held 14 years after debut. On May 21st, Kim ji Won's agency, Hygium Studio, said, We would like to inform you about the illegal transaction of tickets for actress Kim ji Won's Be My One fan meeting. For the fan meeting, we confirmed the suspected reservation fraud, therefore we have take firm action as follows. It's not just Kim ji Won and Lovely Runner who are involved with these ticket scalpers. The music industry has also had ongoing problems with ticket scalpers, and singers such as Lim Young Wong, Sung Si Kyung and Jang Bom Jun have also been known to recently wage war against ticket scalpers. But the reality is that ticket fraud that takes advantage of fans' desires is not easy. This is not only the case in the music industry, but also in the drama industry. Therefore, to eradicate this, we are advised not only to stop illegal transactions, but also to be careful when purchasing tickets via this method. Before this video ends, subscribe first guys, like, comment and notify.